Yes, a crystal amulet. They believe it is a good song. Looks to me like it attracts me. Not in the way. Maybe you bought the wrong one. Have you heard that some people grind them into a powder and then snort it to boost their immune system? I've heard that makes you dizzy. It must be the worst. Oh, How do so things get more than that? Shh. Didn't you listen to the briefing? Another of us has been taken. It's you. Had a feeling we'd cross paths sooner or later. You patched up Barney, right? He whimpered like a baby as soon as he saw the needle. And those renegades, why are they after you? Probably the same reason as you. To access the GRE database. What do you want from it, Aiden? Why are you risking so much? I'm looking for my sister. Your sister was in the GRE? She... No, she was a prisoner. I haven't seen her in 15 years. A prisoner? You mean a test subject? I don't know what I'll find. She's... She's the only family I've got. The only answer to what Waltz has done to us. Waltz? He held us there. Had a hobby of experimenting on kids. Did you know about that? I was only a mid-level doctor, Aiden. I'm sorry. Want to know anything else? Or can we go? How are you planning to get us inside the observatory? Look, there's a security tunnel into the complex. It was locked up years ago. 
Give me the key, Aiden. Are you sure the key is functional? Well, it has been. Maybe the problem is that the building has no electricity. Is there any other way to get in there? It depends how much we're prepared to risk. A lot, if you ask me. Okay. Then come with me. I have something to show you. See those domes? Sure, but the place is flooded with chemicals. The GRE had a solution for that. When they created the THV Gen Mod, they had to protect their employees from exposure. But the THV what? The chemicals. They came up with blockers. Shots that would shield their workers for a few minutes from the fumes. Fortunately, I still have two doses. Had a feeling they'd come in handy one day. Oh, those must be worth a pretty penny. They are extremely rare. For now, we will need only one for you. Wait, you're not coming? No, I, I will join you, but first, I'd like you to restore the power to the building. You see, I have panic attacks when I'm in tight spaces or in the dark. <laughs> now you probably think I'm a coward. Not at all. I think it took guts to come here. So let's do this. When you get there, first restore the power. Then I'll be able to join you. Hold out your arm. Remember, the shot shields you from the chemicals for a limited time only. Can't I take the other one too? No, not at the same time. This stuff's too strong. Go as fast as you can to the smaller dome, and from there to the higher one. You should find a door leading inside. There. You'll be safe. Then head to the B block. There you should find the building's main circuit breaker. As soon as you turn on the electricity, the security door will unlock, and I can join you by going through the tunnel I showed you. Now go. The blocker is working. Aiden, <sighs> I wasn't the blocker is working. Time. That blocker won't protect you forever. Just go and turn on the power. <sighs> <sighs> Initiated. Veronica, I made it through the chemicals to the first dome. Great. Now just get to the second one. Find a door, a hatch, or whatever leads underground. Right. Veronica, found the entrance. So far, so good. But how do you know this place so well, by the way? I was here just once, long ago. But I have a good memory. That sounds useful. Well, sometimes it's a curse. Really. Veronica, I have a horde of infected here. Shit. I hoped it would be empty by now. 
Well, it isn't. I don't know if I can get through. Use the UV flashlight on your belt. That should keep them at bay. Just don't stop, Aiden. I made it. The electricity's on. Great. The security tunnel is open. I'll try to take the elevator down to you. This place was quite the hive. Plenty of infected. But I got rid of them. They were people too, Aiden. They deserve respect. Aiden? What? What's going on? The elevator! It stopped! I see. I think it blew a fuse. Check it. Don't worry, I'll fix it. Please, don't leave me here. Don't be afraid. I just need a moment. Don't leave me. Don't leave me.
I'm working on it. Just let me out! Let me out! I'm not sitting on my hands here, Veronica. Try to breathe. Slowly. Uh, oh. Don't leave me! Just don't leave me here! Shouting won't do anything except attract infected. Yeah, calm down. I won't leave you. Back. You all right? <laughs> Veronica, I'll meet you by the elevators. Are you all right? See? Told you everything would work out. Just get in. Uh, the database, where is it? Just give me a moment. Below us. Even farther than this? Another six floors down. You always been claustrophobic? Seriously? For over ten years. So what happened then? Aiden, for God's sake, can we not talk about this right now? This is... Pretty high tech. Before the GRE, this complex was run by the military. They used it to monitor threats, rocket attacks, that sort of thing. That's why they called it the Observatory. Then the virus came and that was the end. That's quite the story. 
They used to call places like this witnesses to history. Great. Dark again. Wait. I'll try and figure something out. If we have electricity here, we could use it to power up the whole floor. We need to open this door. It's a tight fit in here. Veronica, how are you holding up? to that database and get out of here you're doing great just talk to me why are you really helping me you're taking quite a risk frank told me it was important to you and that's it you probably don't know much about frank and the night runners we owe him well no everything. i'll just plug Ugh. <sighs> 